A black hole has always been a thing of immense wonder. Even the most fervent scientists have been unable to fully understand a black hole. A part of its magnificence probably lies in the fact that it still has certain mysteries associated with it. The more you find out about black holes, the more mesmerized you become. So if you are looking to learn about black holes and possess a desire to try and understand them better, then stick around. This video is just for you. A black hole is a region of space-time exhibiting gravitational acceleration so strong that nothing, no particles or even electromagnetic radiation such as light can escape from it. Most black holes are created when stars implode. The gravity at the center of the star reaches such high values that the star can no longer sustain the reactions that take place at its core. This implosion gives rise to a body of immensely high gravitational pull called the black hole. These black holes are said to have an extremely high gravitational pull which led to the notion that black holes suck in everything around them. Albert Einstein has been credited for predicting the existence of black holes through his general theory of relativity. However, the term black hole was coined by John Wheeler. So we all know that there are trillions of stars out there in the universe and all these stars continuously undergo fission reaction to keep shining. But there comes a point when the star has very little fuel to burn out or the star receives extra matter in a way that does not raise its core temperature. However, in both these cases, the star collapses. If the mass of the collapsing star is greater than a threshold, then it will form a black hole. These black holes are called stellar black holes. The set threshold is called tolman oppenheimer volkoff limit which is around 3 to 4 solar masses. This is not the only way by which black holes can form. Black holes can also form by high energy collisions which can achieve sufficient density. However, till now we didn't detect any such events directly or indirectly probably because of mass imbalance in particle accelerators. Thus, scientists came to the conclusion that there might be some lower boundary of mass for black holes to form and that would lie around the Planck mass. The outer visible part of the black hole is referred to as the event horizon. In other words, the event horizon is the boundary of the black hole. The innermost part of the black hole is what scientists call the singularity. The constituents of a black hole are not quite known to even the most ardent scientists who study black holes. Black holes do not last forever either. In an excruciatingly slow process, black holes emanate energy and become hotter and hotter. Black holes in this process begin to grow smaller and smaller. They eventually disintegrate in a massive and spectacular manner with an explosion. This entire process is attributed to the empty space around the black hole. This disintegration is often referred to as black hole evaporation. To be honest, nobody really knows for sure. It is highly unlikely that you would find someone on the face of the earth who could tell you with a great deal of certainty what exists inside a black hole. The black hole due to its immense gravitational pull does tend to pull most entities that are present in its proximity. However, the belief that it attracts particles and bodies towards it is a misconception. A black hole does not attract entities towards itself it merely consumes the bodies that are already close to it. That is, if an entity is far away from the black hole, the black hole would not cause the entity to move closer towards the black hole. However, if the entity were in the devouring range of the black hole, it would inadvertently get sucked in.
Scientists are now planning to get improved pictures of black holes. Let us hope that uncover the secrets of cosmos and answer some questions which have been daunting scientists from centuries. Neil Armstrong, widely renowned for being the first man to step on the moon, once said, "Mystery creates wonder, and wonder is the basis of man's desire to understand." Perhaps there exists no phenomenon in the world that epitomizes the saying more than a black hole does. Black holes are incredibly fascinating and are surrounded with so much mystery that one cannot help but be enamored by it. I thank you all for watching the video. Please do subscribe to the Atom Stock YouTube channel bottom right hand corner and I will see you in our next video. Take care.